So can you guess who has new symbols? I do. I finally received my tracking symbol set and I couldn't be more happy with it. Tracking Symbols is a company from Turkey and in my opinion they made one of the best and most beautiful symbols in the market. Obviously one of my favorite things is how cool they look. With a combination of copper cathode and tin, the company expires to be one of the world's biggest cymbal manufacturers. In terms of sound, this is all handmade cymbals, so you can imagine how specific and unique they are, which I love. While opening the box, first thing I saw is a gift, which is a bracelet with the company logo, the Black Widow clap stack, and the travel bag. This is my right symbol, raw, serious, 21 inch. It's a B20 end made hammered, medium, medium heavy weight. The volume is medium to low and the sustain is kind of short. The pitch is also low and the timber is dark. Secondly, we have a scrape crash. It's also a hand hammered B20. The weight is medium thin to medium. This one is characterized by a high volume and a medium to high sustain. The pitch is also mid high and the timber mid bright. It has a raw bell and a scrape edge blade. You can also find it with a gold bell. Next, my dry motion crash, which will be my main crash. This is also an 18 inch crash, and the difference between this crash and the other is that this one is a little darker, and the sound is a little less smoky and a bit more focused. This is an ideal crash for using in the studio, playing pop and rock, but you can definitely use it in Latin and jazz music genres. Moving on to the China symbols, this is a very, very special one. This is a dry motion China with an 18 inch size. You can find this one on the product list on the website, but I think it's a public possibility, so it's a question of asking. So this China symbol has a high volume, a bright timber and a mid-low sustain. This is also a raw bell, which helps to control some undesired frequencies, especially in a studio situation. Moving on to the hi-hat, P20 and hammered, medium heavy weight, I chose the raw series as well as the ride. The idea is to match the sound between these two cymbal sessions since they are the same series. I like this ones a lot, especially because the volume is mid to low. I'm hoping to have more freedom to play heavier on the hi-hat without messing up all of the drum sound. This ones also have a short sustain, which I think it will help the same way as well as the precision and tightness of every stroke.
Splash Symbols. This one is a Aris series. Dual finish, raw in the middle, bright at the edge, and it's a very smooth, short sustain and discreet splash. It's perfect when you want to have some notes here and there, very subtly. It's a 12 inch splash with a very dark and very smoky sound. In contrast to the other, this is a Scrape Series 8 inch splash with a very bright and very high volume sound. This one is a gold bell, which makes the cymbal a little more noisy, but since it's such a small cymbal, I wanted it to be louder. Scrape finish, which helps the smoothness of the cymbal, but at the same time, that bright line around it helps the impact of every hit. The Scrape Gold Line Fast Duo Stack Symbol offers the perfect blend between volume, sustain, and brightness. This is the combination of a 12 inch all out splash scrape finish and a 14 inch china. As a high volume and short bright sustain, medium thin weight, providing a balanced feel and a versatile playability for a variety of music sounds, which for this kind of cymbals is perfect for dynamic performances and recordings and quick precise action. Last but certainly not least, we have the Black Widow Clap Stack 4 Pieces. This is made out of 4 cymbals Black Widow series, the 8, 10, 12 and 14 inch. You can find other sizes on the website. Craft with the premium B20 pure bronze and meticulously hand hammered to offer a versatile and impactful sound with a mid-low volume and a very short sustain actually sounds like a clap and definitely can be used as a snare on some music genres. This black paint and sanded finish is combining the unique aesthetic and modern sound. And a nice thing to know is that even separately, they do have an interesting sound.
final conclusions. One thing that I can tell you is that what you got from this video does not make justice to reality. They are way more beautiful and they sound way better. This is a very big change on my sound and a very positive improvement, especially on my recordings. A thing that got a lot of my attention on this cymbals was that clap stack Black Widow. In between a snare and a stack cymbal, if that makes sense at all. I did try something like that before from other companies, I didn't like it that much and this one I just love it. My stack cymbal, size, sound is a very small symbol for the sound he has. An explosion stack with a minimal size. While playing with these symbols on my drum set, in my experience, you have the feeling that the drums are already mixed. The symbols sound so good together and connect so good together, they hug each other. They sound really good and really tight with each other, which is amazing, especially while you're recording or you're playing in small places. At least for me, it's very good when you have a very controlled cymbal sound. You enjoy much your playing while you're playing. So that was it, guys. I will play with tracking cymbals from now on. I'm very proud of this partnership, proud of this sound, and I'm very proud of this cymbal set. So if you like this unboxing videos if you like the reviews if you like the podcast if you like the drum covers i do please consider to subscribe this channel it's just a click costs you less than a half of a half of a minute and it's such a big help for me and for the people that join this channel so why not thank you very much for watching this video of course thank you very much to tracking symbols i'm so proud of this don't forget to get the track and drum symbol set for your drums. Share your thoughts in the comments below. I hope you enjoy it. See you on the next one.